I need you. I'm in the midst of a conversation. Outside, straight away. Is the art of revealing precious truth with words. <laughs> yeah, quite right, brother. In this video, we're diving deep into the world of Bridgerton, that Regency romp that's got everyone talking. And let's face it, there's one Bridgerton brother who's become a bit of an enigma, Benedict. A charming artist, just a self rebel, and the guy who just can't seem to settle down. But the question on everyone's mind, is Benedict Bridgerton gay? Now people, unlike Lady Whistledown's pronouncements, Benedict's story is a little more complex. Remember season 1? Benedict found himself drawn to the artistic world, particularly to a certain Mr. Henry Granville. Let's just say, the bond raised a few eyebrows amongst the ton. Was it just a bromance fueled by artistic passion or something more? Then season 2 throws us a curveball. Benedict pursues the talented artist Tessa. So what gives? Was the Henry thing a youthful exploration in a time of strict social expectations? The showrunners are keeping their cards close to the chest, leaving us to delightfully speculate. In season 1, we saw Benedict forming a close bond with Henry Granville, a fellow artist. This sparked speculation about Benedict's sexuality. But according to Chris Van Dusen, creator and executive producer of the show, the storyline wasn't meant to be about romance. Chris explains that it was more about highlighting tolerance in a time when it wasn't readily accepted. He wants to continue exploring the theme in future seasons. Now in season 2, Benedict pursues a relationship with Tessa, his art school classmate. This shift might have left some fans confused, but Chris clarifies that it was a deliberate choice. Here's the interesting part. Chris says that while Benedict's sexuality wasn't explored as fluid in season 2, it doesn't mean it won't be in the future. He hints that as Benedict navigates his life and place in the family, his journey of self-discovery might also involve his sexuality. So, the mystery of Benedict's president's sexuality still remains. But at least we know the showrunners are open to exploring it further. What do you guys think? Let's discuss in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more content.